Today, Kevin and I are gonna be trying some Knoxville chocolate. This is the Knoxville Chocolate Company. It says, made daily with love. Christy sent us this. Christy uh, lives in Tennessee, and Knoxville is a Knoxville, Tennessee. If that's where they're from. And so, uh, uh, I have actually opened these because I wanted to get a picture for you all. Um, because this was wrapped in plastic so that it was safe mm -hmm. and uh, protected, keep longer. But it smells incredible. Mm -hmm. it smells good. It smells good. very, good. very good. And there's going to be lots of chocolate in here for us to try. I did go to their website because I wanted to know if they told what each chocolate was, what came in the box. And the only thing that it said was that it was an assorted box and it may come with some caramels and some peanut butter and it, it did not tell what they were. That so, looks like a chocolate with Oreo. It does. Let's That's try it first. It, this does look like a chocolate covered Oreo. It won't you just bite it. <laughs> That's exactly what it is. Kevin's making a apart. mess. Making a mess. This is how it looks. It's falling apart, I can't help it. He does. Probably won't be able to save a lot of these for a picture, so. I probably won't. That's good. It's an Oreo dipped in chocolate. <laughs> That's what it is. This. It's like a bonbon. It's wrapped like it looks like a Rolo. Yeah, you know, that's what it reminds me of is a Rolo. Um, I like that or that Oreo. It's good. I like the the, the chocolate. Kind of the bitter chocolate with the sweet chocolate. Oh, um, yeah, it, the bitter of the Oreo, not right. the, not yeah. their chocolate. That yeah, that with the milk chocolate, very very good. I like the um, the thickness of it. It wasn't too much. It was just enough. They did a very good job with that. It um, looks like, looks like just a solid. solid it's just solid chocolate. This is a piece of solid, tastes like dark chocolate. Okay. Hmm. That is dark chocolate. Try that one. Yeah, this one has like that was in it. that was definitely dark chocolate. It would remind you of the Hershey Special Dark. But I don't think it had as much bitterness to it as the Hershey Special Dark. But I like that quite a bit. Was that too dark for you or what did you no, think? No, it wasn't bad. It was sweet. What is this? I don't know. It looks like peanut butter. Peanut butter. Like a mm -hmm. creamy peanut butter. Mm. I like that too. Yeah, that's um very nice sweet peanut butter. It kind of reminds me of Jif peanut butter, honestly. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay. Except in a, a little chocolate. Okay, this. <laughs> this, a little force. <laughs> this looks like a maybe a milk chocolate on top of a dark chocolate. It's layered. Mm. Very creamy chocolate. Let's go. It tastes like a little bit of hazelnut. Did you get a hazelnut hit out of? There is something different about that one. I think it's hazelnut. I think I would have to eat the rest of it, and I'm going to leave it for a picture. I bet you this is dark. This is dark. Oh, no. But it did, it it's did remind home. me of hazelnut. I don't know what it was, but that is what it reminded I me of. I can't say this one. Okay. Mm, that's um, it's caramel, but it's maple. Mm -hmm. That's a maple. Maple caramel. That's really good. I don't like that So far, that's my favorite one. Mm. Probably because it's the strongest we've had. That's true. It's a strong flavor, mm -hmm. but it's really good. Mm. I like that, that was, maple. Um, it, yeah, it, it was a maple cream. It was very, very runny. Mm -hmm. I I like that one too a lot. Now I couldn't eat a whole box of those, or no, because be it would be so sickly, sickly sweet. sweet. Yeah, oh. it's really, really sweet. Mm -hmm. You can just break one of those. This right. looks like a um, a white chocolate covered pretzel. I'm assuming that's pretty obvious. Captain Obvious. <laughs> <laughs> I think this might be a pretzel. <laughs> Some people might have thought it was a light bulb. <laughs> You're such a tired. That was delicious. That was really good. I got like the amount of salt. Wow. 
Yeah, you do get a lot of salt. Mm -hmm. And I love white chocolate. White chocolate's my favorite. White chocolate That's the only good, white chocolate in here. A white chocolate and a really good salty pretzel. You can't hardly beat it. Okay, this What's might that? be salted caramel because it has the salt on the top. That's salt what it is. I think this is sea salt caramel. Good texture. Wow. Good salt. That's salt. Good strong salt. I like that. I do too. I didn't get a lot of caramel, but I got a lot of salt and chocolate. Because if good. they're gonna say sea salt caramel, then it better have some salt. And that had the salt. Mm, that was good. I do get caramel too. I do too. But the, the caramel, it's not as strong as some caramel we've had. Right. Now this is caramel. That looks like caramel too, doesn't it? Or does thought. that look like chocolate? No, that's chocolate. It's like a chocolate mousse. It's chocolate. Or truffle. Mmm. That is a truffle. Mm -hmm. Good and soft and creamy. Almost like a pudding almost in the middle. But it's dark. Yeah. I like it though. It's super sweet though. Mmm. I like that one. That like that one almost as much as I do that maple one. It's, it, but I, that surprises me because it's so dark. See, I don't get a dark flavor from it. This is big and lumpy and thick. Probably has pecans in it. That's my guess. It's gonna have pecans. Or I coconut. really like that one too. Mm -hmm, it's good, one. But it was so dark oh. that it surprised. Oh, I that's said it's coconut. gonna be pecans or coconut. And it's coconut. Oh wow. And their milk chocolate is very light. Mm -hmm. It's a light color, I mean. Mm, it's good coconut. I love the sweetness of the coconut. I love the flakes. Mm, it's good. And there's a lot of texture to it. Really gives your mouth something to work with. Yeah, yeah it's actually full flakes of coconut. Mm -hmm. mm, that's good. That was very, very good. Very sweet. These. All of them are sweet. Yeah, this, sick, I, yeah I know. It's like we're, we're getting sweeter and sweeter, it seems. Okay, now this one is flat, and it looks like a dark chocolate. I did go to their website. It's uh, Knox, K-N-O-X, C-H-O-X, dot com. You can order online. So I don't know if Christy ordered online or if she went to, if they sell these at a store. I bet they have a store locally. Or they might sell these in their grocery stores. Mm -hmm. It's caramel. Mm -hmm. But it's not that sweet. No, they don't have a really super sickly sweet caramel. But they're good. This one looks it's like it not as sweet as like we had that one with the salt, the sea salt caramel. Yeah. The sea salt caramel I thought was sweet. But now this, that one that we just had was not very sweet. I wonder if the salt kind of added to that. And so between the two, I would much rather have the one with the salt. Now this one, that looks like um, it's a, like, like a dark, a dark chocolate sea salt caramel. That's exactly what it is. Mm -hmm. But I love the flavor of their dark chocolate. Mm, that's good. It's not bitter at all. No. And it would say it's not dark enough. But I'll tell you what, you know it's dark. Mm -hmm. But it's, it's delicious. Andrew would be happy with these because they actually say there actually has the salt flavor. It reminds me of like um, like hot chocolate. That's what yeah, the, I can, yeah. I can see that. like when you you it's make a, a Hershey's um, cocoa um, hot chocolate. That's what their dark chocolate reminds me of, and it's delicious. This is peanut butter and Mm-hmm. Mm. Their peanut butter is a really good creamy peanut butter. I swear it's like Jif peanut butter. It's really good. Which I love, Jif peanut butter. Mm. It's delicious. Mm hmm. Because a lot of peanut butters are not sweet enough and they don't have a strong enough peanut butter flavor. Right. That has a strong peanut it butter is. flavor. And it's not just peanut flavor, no, it's actually it's a peanut butter. Yeah. This is rounded is on top. Second no. last one. And it's it's like a now that one looks like it might have stuff in it. Coconut or pecans again. We've had one with coconut, so you don't I don't think it'll be coconut. Ooh, it's, like it's a marshmallow. marshmallow. Oh. 
Yeah, it's it's a marshmallow on the bottom layer and then caramel in the whole dome part of it. You want that one? <laughs> I was gonna go on the stuck in the winter, but the other way. They're very ladylike licking my fingers. I like that one. That one, the dark chocolate comes out a little bit warm. Mm -hmm. That's not my favorite, but I do like it. It's not my favorite either because I I don't think it had as much flavor it didn't. as I, some of the other ones. It didn't. It was dark chocolate and then a little bit of that marshmallow flavor is what I got. I I'm assuming this one's going to be like a raspberry. I, yeah, I think it's going to be a raspberry or a strawberry because it has, it has a pink pink color on top. Now, I will take a picture and have it at the end of what is left on the plate. Mm -hmm. Just know that, I, do you think that's gonna be strawberry or raspberry? Mm -hmm. Just know that there were a, at least one that I think we ate the whole thing. Mm, raspberry. Mm, wow. That was a good, strong raspberry nut. That's so good. Would you guess that raspberry? Mm -hmm. It's definitely raspberry. I think that beats the raspberry creams from Russell Stover's and Whitman's. You know it's why? Whitman's, Whitman's. I think we like it because it's in milk chocolate, not dark chocolate. And it's very, very strong. It, it, yeah, it's extremely strong. I mean, that's but like I love it. raspberry jelly. Yeah, I absolutely love it. That's exactly. It, it's like you've you've eaten it out of the container uh, of jelly, but it has chocolate with it. That is so good. Mm. Yeah, the maple cream is the only one. They can sell that. whole boxes of just, just that. those. Yes, those are, in, and it's incredibly sweet. I like all these. There's nothing that I really didn't dislike. Um, nothing that I disliked. There were some that were plainer than others. Yeah, oh but yeah. None that I disliked. Yeah, there were, let's put it this way. I wouldn't be unhappy with this box of chocolate. No, it's not at all. Buy. This is delicious. It's it good truly chocolate. is. And I'm not saying that just because Christy sent it to us. Because mm. we didn't like any of them, I would definitely tell you. Because I don't ever want you all to go to the websites and waste your money. Because I wouldn't want anybody to do that to me either. Mm. So... From the heart, I'm telling you, this is really, really good. Really good. Uh, did you have a favorite though? Um, I like the coconut one a lot, but I like that that dark chocolate, the truffley one. I yeah. almost liked it about as good as any. That was very good. And the raspberry one. I think. And the the salted caramel. One. And those and, three. Now those three. Okay, so we're picking three. The, that's mine. The dark, oh. the chocolate truffley one, the coconut one, and the lighter, the milk chocolate uh, caramel salt. Sea salt caramel. I mean, and the raspberry. Okay. Okay. I'm going to say the raspberry number one. That was really good. The coconut number two. And the sea salt caramel number three. Yeah. The pretzel was good too. The pretzel it was, was delicious. Good. It was the only, like I said, the only white chocolate in there. I'm wondering if that's because white chocolate might be more expensive to do. Mm. I don't know. My, the only one I really they could left it out was the marshmallow one. you know i think that i agree the marshmallow and the caramel just because it had the plainest mm -hmm. flavor out of all yeah. of them and maybe it's because the marshmallow took some of that away you could wouldn't be. think that you would think marshmallow would add more sweetness but because the other ones were so sweet that probably was the plainest one in the right. box yep. very very good though thank you so much to christy um i'm gonna have a picture for you all at the end i hope you enjoyed the review and thanks for watching